Hi, I'm Paige Hudson, author of the programs you see here at Elemental Science. And today, I want to take you on a tour of our Sassafras Science Series. Here at Elemental Science, we believe in the three keys to teaching science. So our Sassafras Science Series includes hands-on demonstrations, reading from an adventure pack novel, and customized notebooking sheets. The Sassafras Science Series is designed for the elementary years. During these years, your students can learn about animals, the human body, plants, and more through the eight volumes of our series. Let's take a look at the activity guide and logbook. Our Sassafras Science activity guides begin with a thorough explanation of the components in the program. This is followed by the book list with the required books and a list of optional library books. Then you will find a list of demonstration materials and project supplies broken out by unit and week. The list of characters rounds out the introductory materials. After the introduction, you will find the chapter lesson sheets. Each one begins with a summary of the chapter, followed by the supplies needed for the activities and two scheduling options for that week. Turn the page to find the science-oriented books section with the main spine reading from the Sassafras Science Adventures novel, plus suggested encyclopedias, and optional additional books you can look for at your local library. This is followed by the notebooking section, which gives you the potential answers to the SIDAT logbook pages for the main information sheets and the individual record sheets. Flip the page and you will find vocabulary words to highlight for the chapter. After that, you will see the demonstration for the chapter. This section includes the materials you will need, the instructions for the demonstration, plus an explanation. On the final page of the chapter in the activity guide, you will see the multi-week project and activities section. For each novel, there is a project for the students to complete, one that relates to the subject matter of the novel and takes several weeks to finish. After this, you will find several STEAM activities related to the specific topics from the week. And finally, you will see optional copy work and dictation. After the 18 chapter sheets, you will find the appendix, which contains the useful templates and pictures you can use as you work through the activity guide. These templates are followed by a glossary of the vocabulary terms. And finally, in the rear of the activity guide, you will find the optional quizzes. Now, let's take a look at the SIDAT logbook, which begins with a table of contents for easy reference. Each location section begins with a main information sheet, where students can record information they've learned about broader topics from the novel. This is followed by the geography sheet, where the students can do a bit of map work related to what they've read. After this, you will find the four individual record sheets, where the student can record what they've learned about the specific topics from each chapter. This is followed by the note sheet, where the students can record any additional information you cover from the location. Finally, each location will have a blank record sheet, where the students can make a scrapbook page of any additional projects they do. In the rear of the SIDAT logbook, you will find a glossary for the students to fill in as they work through the novel. We also offer coloring pages and a lap booking guide to go along with the Sassafras Science programs. Each of the programs in our Sassafras Science series have been designed to give you the tools you need to take your students on an exciting journey through a living book to learn about science. Visit ElementalScience.com to get started today.